Yo, what's good, Chris? Your partner, Jess Mike. And we're finishing the last of these solos, I think, maybe, for Color Rush. And this one actually is pretty dope, man. I think we're going to get a Color Rush player. So let's go ahead and finish this game, man. Um, wasn't too hard. Wasn't too hard. Knocking out these solos, man. But I think we're going to get a Terrence Williams item. Don't know if he's going to be gold or elite. Kind of want to see his stats, though. Kind of want to see his stats. And we also get 2,500 coins, which is really, really nice. And we're going to get a Terrence Williams item. All right. This is an elite card. Really nice, man. 85 overall. And wow. This guy is a beast, dude. 89 speed, right? Almost 90 speed, which is epic right now. 6'2", 86 catching, 90 spec catch, 89 catching traffic. This guy is a beast. 86 route running. Got to look at his run block. Uh, I know his run block has been low this year, but last year was pretty decent. I, well, at least his uh, Campus Heroes card was really decent. So his run block here is 49. Still kind of low, man. Oh, man, if this run block was 59, it would be totally epic. But this guy is a great pull. Uh, he's definitely going to be in my starting lineup. He may actually be my starting slot receiver now. You know what I mean? Um, and I got to say, with the Color Rush promo, hey, listen, there's a good side and a bad side with the promo. I'm going to be honest with you. The set is really, really cumbersome. It's worth it to get the uniforms, and it's worth it if you really want to go after the Todd Gurley and to get um, elite players, and that's cool. But to be honest with you, the solos are way better, man. The solos, for those of you who are who done them, the solos are way better because the badges that you get, you can sell those, do the, do the uniforms you want to do, sell those badges, get coins and the coins that you get and also this great player man so yeah man let's go ahead and uh add this guy to our squadron and i would suggest anybody to do the color rush solos i don't know if you can like if you miss a day then you miss out you know or is it just you can do these and then depending on what you do you know i don't know i don't know how it goes but uh let's see here let's look back at the solo challenges really quickly and see and let's go ahead and buy some contracts my contracts are very low man as you see we're not opening that many packs right now so contracts kind of low and I've been busting out these solos man like crazy so yeah Thursday night football come on man I just bought contracts chill out let's see here As you can see, we completed all of these, and I mean, it really wasn't that bad, spaced out, you know what I mean? And I don't know if, like, if you miss a day, can you do them, or are they just available all the time? But I would suggest you guys to do these Color Rush solos, definitely for the coins, definitely get those uh, items, those team items, which you can sell for, like, 2,000 coins, 3,000 coins, and make your money. And on top of that, You'll be getting a Terrence Williams item. Now, this is this is what I like about EA. This is a perfect example of a great non-auctionable, non-tradable player. Definitely. All right. So, let's go ahead and add this guy to the set real quick. If they don't stop bugging me about these contracts. Let's go ahead and add this dude to the set, man. And I guess uh, take out John Brown. Even though John Brown is a beast right there. Definitely put in. Ooh. So I'll have to. Okay, well. Let's substitute for tired depth chart. And who we have here? Tyreek Hill. Now, don't hate on Tyreek Hill. If you guys don't know, look at his stats. All right, don't, don't hate on him just yet. He don't have the best catching stats, but he got that speed, bro. And trust me, cross the middle and drags, he kills all the time. Fresh player, especially subbing him in. Don't start him, but you sub him in. Got a good player, bro. All 
And let's go ahead and put John Brown back in. Tired death chart. And yeah, man, Terrence Williams is on the squad. Like I say, man, perfect example of a uh, great non-auctionable tradable player for solos. Like, this is what you want. Uh, have no problem with it. Definitely going to help my squad out. And, you know, definitely um, is worth doing the solos for. But that's it for this one. Want to know what you guys picked up today. There is some flashback players out there. Uh, well, who is it? Um, Calais Campbell, I believe, and Mikey Upati. And um, I want to know what you guys think. But that's it for this one. I'll see you guys on the next one, man. Terrence Williams is on the squad, bro. We got him. I'm out. Peace.